Parents coming together in Apopka following this terrifying scene at a Pop Warner football practice. An 11-year-old accused of grabbing a gun and shooting two 13-year-olds Monday night. League officials held an emergency meeting last night in hopes of easing parents' fears. News 6's Ezzy Castro joins us live from the Juvenile Detention Center where that boy is being held. And Ezzy, a judge ordered him to stay behind bars. Julie, he'll have to stay here for about three weeks. Now, that court hearing happened just hours before parents with the football league met for an emergency meeting at the rec center. We are hearing reaction from parents of football players with the Pop Warner League in Apopka. The emergency meeting was held last night in effort to talk about safety after investigators say an 11 year old pulled out a gun and shot two 13 year olds after a fight over chips Monday night. I think the staff handled everything um, very well. Initially things were were chaotic, uh, but things but the staff stepped in, the coaches stepped in and calmed everything down. The 11 year old suspect appeared at the juvenile justice center yesterday morning. One of the victim's aunts testified before the judge, saying he should be held accountable along with the boy's mother. It was very negligent of the parent to leave that weapon available for that child to get to where it was already loaded and ready to go. The attorney representing the little boy calling the whole situation a tragedy. This started with a group of 13 year olds bullying an 11 year old to the point where they wouldn't let him eat. They attacked him. So that attorney stressed that the 11 year old is actually not doing well away from home, but based on his attempted murder charge, the judge says the little boy will have to stay behind bars. Live in Orlando, Ezzy Castro, and results C6.